Okay, so this is uh, this is my TV with my SD to SNES, and as you can see here, <laughs> I think I have made significant progress on the title screen. I finally inserted the rest of the logo. This is all done with those sprite tiles, and let me tell you something. This was the biggest pain in the ass I've ever done ever. Just it, it was very hard. Now there's a problem. Everything's great. But Kamek is here, and he's floating up and down, and he erased himself. Well, he, he went away because the sprites, I'm displaying like 60 sprite tiles on the screen, so Kamek slowly vanished, his sprite tiles went away. So I need to know, is there any way to make him come back? Now he is the eerie sprite, and there is two frames of animation on that eerie sprite, and I'm actually using one frame of an animation, so maybe it might be, maybe I can go into the code and delete a frame of animation or something, it might, maybe that'll make him appear. The only other way I know of is the SA1 chip to do that, and I need a little, you know, help on that, because I think what you have to do is you have to implement the SA1 before you insert the sprites. Now, I have lots of backup ROMs of my ROM, so I could always just and I have, you know, this sprite is done, you know, this Mario sprite, it's done as a sprite. So I could always go to one of my old ROMs and then make the SA1 compatible thing and then insert the sprite after the fact to make Kamek move on screen because I would, I really want him to move on screen. So anyway, I might be doing an SA1 thing on this. Um, anyway, uh, so title screen is significant progress has been made on this and I'm very happy to see this.